All right, we're gonna go for a ride in uh, one of my favorites, a 1971 Chevy C10 pickup, short bed. So it's a half ton short bed deluxe version. So the deluxe has like the scrolled seat and the wood grain. Um, this one's got a custom steering wheel on it, which kind of matches the theme, you know? It's got some scrolling on it, which I think is kind of neat for an aftermarket wheel. I had it re-leathered, you know, it's a little worn out, and I'm like, you know, the scroll matches the seat, let's leather it, so. That looks really good. It's got an AM FM CD radio in the dash there. Uh, it's a 350, 350 turbo automatic, four barrel carburetor. It's got aluminum intake on it. Uh, it's a nice driver, man. Air conditioning, blows cold. Uh, so it's something you could use as a daily driver if you want to look cool doing it. You know, these car, these trucks were, they're real trucks back then. They got a full frame. You could tow with them. I mean, a short bed, you don't want to do too much. Maybe a boat or something like that. You know, a little boat or jet skis or a utility trailer but they're pretty neat you know they're easy to drive they're small you can put three people in the front seat and for an older vehicle a classic truck at least you got power steering power disc brakes and air you know those are the things that everybody wants there's some upgrades you could do if you wanted you know some guys are putting LS motors in these things and they're getting really pricey actually you know for for what what they are you know but they're popular it's why they're the money but it's a good driver, and uh, I'll show you some pictures and video of it up here, and that's uh, pretty clean. Nice old truck. All right, here's our newest edition, 1971 Chevrolet Custom C10 Deluxe. Love these trucks, man. They look really cool and two-tone, too. This is an original black truck with black interior. Kind of rare, you know, a lot of them are green and yellow and funky colors, but black is beautiful. This one's got all the trim. It's got a uh, the rally wheels on there, the 15-inch uh, GM rallies. Um, nice chrome bumpers. It's got a spray-in bed liner. Line-X, which is good this way, you know. The bed was really straight on this truck, but to, to do the Line-X, you can put a surfboard in the back or your bike, mountain bike, skateboards. You, know, you can still use it without scratching it up. You're not freaked out about hurting the bed. But tailgate's in good shape. Solid truck, California truck, two owner. It's a 350 with a turbo 350 automatic transmission. It's got power disc brakes, power steering. Slightly lowered. It's got drop spindles and uh, springs in the back. So it rides normal. You know, the spindles are nice when they do that because it doesn't change the geometry of the truck. It just lowers the suspension a little bit. So you can still put stuff in the back if you want. But nice trim, bumpers, chrome. The paint's 8 out of 10, still looks really good, it's all polished up real nice. It's got the dual sport mirrors on it. Interior's nice. Seat looks like it was redone. It's got the scroll work on it, which the Deluxe has, with the wood grain. AM, FM, CD, stereo, like I said earlier, working air conditioning, which is nice. Gauge package. Doesn't have a tilt wheel, but they sell those if you want to add a tilt column. But but everything is pretty stock other than that, you know. Motor was replaced uh, with a GM replacement crate motor years ago, locally here. Um, but overall, just a great looking truck. Here's the power plant in the 71 C10. Um, this thing came with a 350, still has a 350. It's just a newer crate motor. A couple performance goodies on there. It's got some headers. It's got aluminum intake, Edelbrock carburetor, um, runs really good, just a good little truck. There's the factory power disc brakes up front, it was factory air and that still works. Pretty cool, it's got a trans cooler also right there, in case you tow something but you probably won't with this. I'll go fire it up for you. Fire in the hole. Really good, just a nice uh, nice running, small block. You can clean up this engine compartment if you wanted to. A lot of guys go over the top and chrome everything and you know, but right now man, it's a driver. It's a good driver too. Something you could use as a daily. Dual exhaust all the way out the back. Like I said, stock motor, so probably got about, I don't know, upper twos to 300 horsepower, plenty. But something you could, uh, reliable that you could drive to work if you want. Well, if you want to see this one in person, come out to California Cars. We're at 2158 Union Place in the city of Simi Valley, California. 
Uh, phone number is 818-591-1313. Uh, my name is Rich. I'd be happy to give you the tour of the truck and the rest of the good stuff we got in the shop. Thanks for watching.